it's fucking hard. It's hard to talk. Omricon is what I've got. Day three. Day three is not as bad. It's day two. Day one. Went that bad. Yesterday. Well, I haven't moved off this bed all day yesterday. Nor today. Constantly sweating, but constantly cold. Each and every muscle feel like I've been kicked and kicked and battered. I ache. I ache everywhere. Every single muscle ache. Breathing is is okay. My breathing's really good. My organs are good. I'm all good. I'm just going through this fucking horrible chills, sweat, and aches and pains like. Oh, muscle fatigue and aches and pains that like I've never experienced before. But I am feeling, even on day three, a little bit better. I haven't eaten anything. I've decided to fast for 72 days, uh, just on liquids, and to to give my oh, my self healing powers, I put them to work overtime. I'm not drinking anything out of the fridge. All what I am drinking is, is just liquids that are at room temperature or, or just above so I'm not putting any strain or stress on the digestive system so I'm not sweating any more than I have to. Oh man. I'm on Kotel by the way so it's overcast out there today. I did get up and go and sit on the balcony. Uh, last night I did, I, actually last night I was I really uh, just laying here but I, I can't sleep because I, I, uh, every, uh, when I lay down, if you're laying everywhere has got pain so it's, I've got to lay flat and still on the back and I say still because the more I move the, the more chills I get but I'm just telling you the symptoms of what, what I've got. Uh, but I know in a couple of days I'm going to be bright as rain again. Uh, hopefully, <laughs> it's just mate, it's just been stuck in this room for X amount of days, self isolating. But I did sit out on the balcony and I had a couple of joints last night. And funny enough, I actually felt a lot better uh, for that period of time. But then I had a little sleep and I woke up. And I, oh God, I had bad heart palpitations around here, so I didn't smoke any more weed. Um, I didn't, no. So I don't know if there's any, there aren't, there aren't no medicines or anything you can take for this. you just got to sit out, I guess. Lay it out, whatever I'm doing. And that, but that's, I've got my liquids, I just stretch to them. The electrolytes, some vitamins, oh man. Your cult, your cult, the cult, you know. Just that's all I'm drinking, really. And I think by tomorrow I'll probably be okay. No, I'm not, not feeling nowhere near as bad as it was yesterday. Yesterday was so bad, I, I couldn't do this yesterday. I wanted to, but I couldn't. So, you know, it's the pains up the back of my neck as well, the headaches and that. The worst is around the back around my arms, it's like I can't lift my arms here. Yesterday it felt like fucking hell, I've been banged to, to bits on my arms, but I'd been sparring for like a hundred rounds with, mate, that was proper sore, proper, totally. So anyway, that's where I am. So I've put this edit in, I have actually, if you see my vlogs, I'm still catching up on the Coast of Miri ones. I've got some of them to edit today, if I can be asked. I don't know, the thing is, it's, it's oh man, no will to do anything. I get, I lay here, I get an idea, I'm like, let's do that. And then I get as far as sitting up on the edge of the bed. Uh, that's as far as I get. And then it's like, I might walk around the room or, and that, but then I'll come and, it, it's, it's funny, every time I get a little bit of sleep, when I wake up, I feel just that little bit better. 
So sleep is very important. If I can get some, because most of the time I can't have the door. Like, so I haven't got a fan on. The door's wide open. It's probably 30 degrees in here. Yet I'm cold. <laughs> Fucking cold. It's like a winter's day, though. So anyway, I don't know what else to say really. I haven't, like I say, I'm losing the will to live. Losing the will to live, but like, yeah, it's like one of them vlogs. But I ain't going to the hospital or nothing like that. I'm just doing this isolation, you know. I'm a responsible person, so I'm just got to stay in this room. And it's cheap because this hotel room is only 200 baht a night, and I'm not on any fees, so I don't need anyone to go shopping for me. There's enough liquids in the house to keep me going for another three or four days. You know? That's all I'm going to be doing. It's just, it's just sitting at three. Uh, but there you go. That's me. I've got the, I've got the COVID. And it's not nice. It could be a lot worse, I guess. But, you know, it's what it is. It is what it is. So guys, I, uh, I thought I'd just bring you up to speed. I'll, I'll edit this in and load this up tonight so you know where I'm at. I am stuck on Kotel. I've made a couple of vlogs here already um, when I first arrived. So I have got you know, something to catch up with. But I'll put this one on tonight. So you, so if, you, if you're wondering why I haven't answered your comments from last night, it's because I can't be honest. I've tried. I've tried, I've read a few, but I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I wanted to, but I, I just ain't got the energy to type or answer them. I'm sorry about that. I am, it's, it's what buzzes me up in the morning, but, oh. Right, I guess that's it, really. <laughs> right, God. enjoy your day, guys. Until next time, au revoir.